Washington the Justice Department said Monday that prosecutors were looking into whether a special counsel should be appointed to investigate political rivals President Trump has singled out for scrutiny, including Hillary Clinton. The department, in a letter sent to the House Judiciary Committee, said the prosecutors would examine allegations that donations to the Clinton Foundation were tied to a 2010 decision by the Obama administration to allow a Russian nuclear agency to buy Uranium One, a company that owned access to uranium in the United States, and other issues. The letter appeared to be a direct response to Mr. Trump's statement on November 3 when he said he was disappointed with his beleaguered attorney general, Jeff Sessions, and that long-standing unproven allegations about the Clintons and the Obama administration should be investigated. Any such investigation would raise questions about the independence of federal investigations under Mr. Trump since Watergate, the Justice Department has largely operated independently of political influence on cases related to the president's opponents. Mr. Trump's statement galvanized conservative news outlets like Fox News and Breitbart News which have since beaten the drum for a special prosecutor to be appointed. People close to the White House said there might be another issue at play, Mr. Sessions might be able to forestall the president firing him by appointing a special counsel to investigate the uranium deal. Mr. Trump blames Mr. Sessions for the cloud of the Russia investigation that has hovered over his 10-month presidency, saying that if Mr. Sessions had never recused himself from the inquiry this year, the special counsel, Robert S. Mueller III, would never have been appointed. On Tuesday, Mr. Sessions is scheduled to testify before the House Judiciary Committee, where he is expected to be questioned sharply by both Republicans and Democrats. The letter was a reply to formal requests from congressional Republicans for a Justice Department inquiry into various Clinton-related issues. Although Mr. Sessions has recused himself from all matters related to the election, he and the Deputy Attorney General, Rod J. Rosenstein, will oversee the prosecutor's decision to appoint the special counsel, the letter said. These senior prosecutors will report directly to the Attorney General and the Deputy Attorney General as appropriate, and will make recommendations as to whether any matters not currently under investigation should be opened, whether any matters currently under investigation require further resources, or whether any matters merit a special counsel, Stephen E. Boyd, an assistant attorney general, said in the letter to the House Judiciary Committee. Rep. Adam B. Schiff, Democrat of California, criticized the Justice Department's letter. Republicans have long tried to link Mrs. Clinton to the uranium deal, which was revealed in the run-up to her 2016 presidential campaign. The deal was approved by the Committee on Foreign Investment in the United States when she was Secretary of State under President Barack Obama and had a voting seat on the panel. Conservative news outlets have kept the storyline alive and pushed the allegations as part of a continuing narrative that the Clintons are corrupt.